welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Noye. so thank you so much for finding time to click on my videos to watch i'd like you guys to travel to, with me to london from lagos via um, doha so we left home at 4 a.m and this is on our way to the international airport in lagos and it was still very dark and we we're saying goodbye to lagos nigeria so we got in and there was a lot of time wasting i had to check in eight bags because of course i was traveling with three children and so at this point i had to get to the part where we no, want to show the wrapping process when it's rolling no you want to see the way it is rolling I want to see the full process of wrapping. <laughs> full process of wrapping. <laughs> Wrap our bags, and I had two boxes, two traveling bags, four Ghana must go. My daughter was interested in seeing how this wrapping process was done, and so she decided to film this one. But I just want you guys generally to see how my journey was and how the event was for me i decided to travel via qatar airways because i've heard a lot about this airline and i've seen a lot of reviews and this year they won the best airline this year last year year before last so they've been consistent in their winnings and in their ways of relating with passengers and a lot of people have given a very good reviews and honestly that was why i decided to travel with qatar and i'm going to be sharing with you some of the things i enjoyed and so after we finished wrapping, we checked in our four bags because of course four um, carry-on bags, of course, because we were four. So my children had the chance to get balloons. I don't know who was sharing balloons, what was they were celebrating. But when we got to the immigration, they seized the balloons from them. They said they were not going to be allowed to take it to the aircraft, and so the balloon did not get in to make it to the journey. So this was time. Well, my daughter was waiting for her own balloon, but unfortunately she didn't get even after I told that there was no point waiting for balloon, but it let's go so that I would not even miss our flight or travel late, right? So this was time where we were saying goodbye to family members and hugging and saying by taking pictures and then just generally leaving. Uh, at this point, I was supposed to feel the yellow card and i had i filled just one when i got back to the immigration i was made to fill the remaining three so the remaining three for my children so i was only feeling one so i had a church member who is also a family member this man has been very amazing when my husband was traveling he was the one who went with us and made sure things went well and so he's here again to help me out and the children and it's been very amazing very supportive um, family member there my sister was there filming my mom was there she was just looking at me like god so this is my daughter that i say hello to every day is not going to be with me again so and boom it was time to leave after we finished rushing and i rushed everybody ladies and gentlemen we were still asked to sit down to wait to board that they were loading all the bags and the aircraft was right behind us you know it was just feeling cool waiting so it was time to board i like the consideration for people with children the elderly and the people who were less privileged kind of so i enjoyed that privilege of traveling with three, three children we were the first set of people to board and so we found our way straight up to the aircraft my children were excited they, i think what was my more ex, most exciting for them was because they're going to see their father you know so i liked this um okay guys so this is um my um, screen um, you guys, this is my first time I was, I'm really nervous. Yes, I get yeah. Okay, yeah. so we're gonna collide. Setting. Qatar has always been very beautiful from reviews, and I honestly found that today they are seats are very good, the entertainment is awesome, everything about it, what I saw, my experience, honestly. It was really good now i'm beginning to see why people have been giving them very good reviews and why more people have been traveling with them the next one let's see what's on there oh, oh, toothbrush and toothpaste mm -hmm. very good yeah. yeah but what again do you have you have, yes. a, you have a soft and he, you are wow the oh you have a sleep mask fantastic that's what you have 
this was before we took off i was more interested in seeing the map i was looking for my village on the map i don't know what i was looking for honestly but i was checking the map to track the our journey from ikeja Mohamed Salam Mohammed International Airport to Doha. It was really interesting that I could just follow up after my journey. And then all the places I'd been to, I was trying to look for them on the map and locate them. I don't know why that was really fascinating for me, but this screen was giving me life. And I like the fact that the entertainment on this um, um, flight was really, really good. I also want to check out what kind of entertainment they had. So it was just basically Hollywood, Bollywood, Nollywood, and Arabic. They had some games and they had the kids' sessions. And I just wanted to see all of that before I continued my flight. That was just it, pretty much. <laughs> Man, that's his belt. One, two, three. Hurry. Sit belt, sit belt. There's no other God like you. All that, oh Lord, you are God. There is no one else like you. Oh my God, all that, oh the you are great. There's no other God like. I wanted to check out the entertainment they had. They had Nollywood, Hollywood, Bollywood, and Arabic, and they had some other very nice games and kids section. So I decided to get a little bit entertained, even though, to be honest, I was not interested in any of the movies. I was rather watching the map. This has to be the favorite part of this journey for me while I was booking this flight. I chose child meal option and it avails me the opportunity of getting the lunch box that has the main dish and other sides with um, desserts with everything in it. And after this pack, they were also given another pack, more like the snack pack that had a lot in it. And so when they were bringing this for me in them, um, on the plane a number of people were wondering why my children were getting this uh, special attention because if you do not choose it they uh, you have children the children will just get ordinary normal meal like other adults but if you choose child meal you will get this cutter pack for both like your food right use it just use a cutlery very yummy wow you really like it Let me see. Like you, Jaja. You like it? You like it? It's hot, right? Sorry. Jaja, do you like it? You really like it. Wow, that's nice. This food is so nice. Jaja likes it. He loves it. Like it. Sure. Sausage. Sausage, right? Yeah, yeah let me see.
then when my own meal finally came i really enjoyed it it was really good right i i enjoyed every part of the meal and i just want to share it with you guys and that's it This is the second park I talked about after the main park. So it was served, I think, two hours at the end of the journey. So this has juice, it has chocolate, it has sandwich, and it has fruit in it, of course, with um, cutlery to go with it. So if you're looking to book Qatar Airways, just use this option. At this point, I kept checking the map. I think we had about two hours, there's nine minutes to the end of our flight, and I kept checking. Other people were getting entertained and watching their favorite movies and I was just checking the map just to see how far I was going. And I like the idea of just being with the captain or with the pilot on every step of the way. But hey, it's all good. I enjoyed this flight honestly. So this was the last pack that came. So at this junction all the adults got this pack. So I was worried why they still give the children this pack. So that's three packs now. The first one was the one that came with the lunch pack. The second one that was the one that came with the paper pack. And this is the third one that these children are getting on this flight. So people were wondering, how come these children are just getting all these special looking packs while other children weren't getting it? That was why I said that if you are looking to use Katariwis and you're traveling with your children, it's important that you um choose child meal and when you choose child meal it's already customized so they're going to give them all the available stuff for children so let's check out the lavatory good one and i did a quick ootd like getting ready to get out of the flight because i know that hey, the journey ahead is good so tired but hey we move At this point, we were planning to land in Doha. The journey of seven hours was about to come to an end. It was a long journey. I was stressed, but hey, I was still very strong because I knew we had um, seven hours, 40 minutes layover. That's about eight hours layover until our next flight that was due for midnight. And I was going to also manage these three children. So I had to be very strong and get ready to get out of this flight and see what to do. So blurry. Ah, it's not so bright, but this view is so beautiful. Boy, it's blurry. Ah, boy, it's clear, clear. So beautiful. Wow. Ah, ah. This runway was just giving me vibes. Just look at this runway from the screen. It looks very good. And don't mind me, I was comparing this runway with the runway <laughs> of my old country, Ninja. From the Mohammed International, Musala Mohammed International Airport in Lagos. I was comparing runway, you could should just see me. But this runway eh, from this screen was so beautiful. I don't know, this um, Doha is so, such a beautiful place. And people have talked about the airport that it's one of the be most beautiful airports in the world. And I think I agree based on everything that I saw. So we're preparing to land and I will let's capture it everything in fact from the time we touched down to the wrong way until when we finally alighted i just wanted to capture every moment well i thought i'd share that with you and this is about um 7 17 30 that's 5 30 do her time but 3 30 nigerian time and so we finally landed guys why 
I found this <laughs> Say hello. We finally landed to God be the glory to Satan be shame. We found the famous lamb bear. This lamb bear that every YouTuber that has traveled to Doha showed. I have finally seen it. So I thought to share with you people. It's a beautiful one. My children have been looking forward to this lamb bear. See, my daughter is so excited. I am very happy after she saw the lamb bear. But it's a good one. Okay, a quick one at the immigration as soon as we landed in Doha. They checked our bags and all the drinks and water and juice and everything we came with. They took everything. I was wondering why we were coming into the airport. We were not going into the aircraft. So I was wondering why would you take the drinks? We got them from the aircraft. Why would you take them from us? So they told the children to finish it right there and then and I didn't like the idea, but hey, it is what it is. That is what it is. So at this junction, we're trying to locate our next gate. It wasn't available at this point, but so the children and I we were just trying to look for our, our way around the airport. We had seven hours, 40 minutes layover, and we were on the translator. This translator, I've seen it on every YouTube video that we've watched, and it was interesting to also be on that same translator that everyone had shared at some point. So at this point, after we got out of the translator, we started to look for the play area. Somebody talked about the play area, but I didn't find it immediately. But when we saw one of the staff decided to ask, and then directed us to the side to the wing C part of the airport where the lamb bear is. So the lamb bear is like the major point where you have to find other gates. So they're like gates A, B, C, D, E. Can you stop? Go and buy now. Can I go there? To where? So I kept checking the board to see our time, but it wasn't available until I think three two hours to the flight but then it was available on my app like four hours to the flight that was that's something i think you should do if you are going to qatar just check that flight or just check your app now my children had the opportunity to eat the rest of the snack of course without the drink that been taken from them so that's why i said you see that child meal thing is a good idea to this because they couldn't finish everything but so and they had to eat the rest of their stuff here yeah. so at this junction we were still going around around the village and looking around the airport. This airport is beautiful. You know, seven hours was so short. I thought seven hours was a lot of time. So people were wondering, how are you going to do seven hours with three children? These children were just playing and having fun. By the time we finished from the immigration to when we ate, to when we saw the play area, and we went to settle back to find our gates, ladies and gentlemen, seven hours was over. Seven hours from the short, in short. Eight hours was over. So, guys, the FIFA World Cup is starting in um, November, right? Hey, don't push it. Don't touch the ball. We're getting ready for Qatar 2022. That's going to be in November. This airport will be crowded, like crowded. <laughs> hey, Debo, come, come, come. Don't touch anything. You're not supposed to touch. You're not allowed to touch. You can't have one. Hmm. Yeah, just having fun. Well, let me try. No, don't try. So we finally found the play area and the children had time to. Jack, be careful, Jack. Debo. Debo, be careful. Hey, Debo. Jaye. Ticket. Good job. Hey, careful, careful, Jaja, ja, careful. Take turns, please. Wait for her. Take turns. Good. It was time to take a short nap before the next flight. So this was the next flight from Doha to LHR. That's the London Heathrow. And it's a five hour flight. It was the A380 800 flight with a capacity of over 461 passengers. Mulwe. <laughs> no, mind me, the size of the 
passenger first scared me like ah, ah, 461 but this last one that we bought it was like 242 or so but it's all good but you know Qatar is very organized so I didn't even feel like it was Mulu so full time as usual the children's park still came again this same park that was how we carried Bugweru park so they had food and cake this time it was yogurt it's same different kind of yogurt there was chocolate there was butter there was a croissant ah yeah croissant <laughs> there was drink yeah there was drink and then there was ketchup i guess so it was really good in that park so but this particular food in the park my children they didn't like this one so in fact my one of my sons they didn't touch it at all the second one tried to eat it, but in on this flight we were more sleepy. Then this is the second pack that came. This one had drink, chocolate, sandwich, and fruit. The second pack, right as usual. But I was as sick on this flight and I couldn't do so much, honestly. But when I told one of the cabin crew about how I felt, she kept coming back to ensure that I was good, and then she gave me water. There was a time she brought me hot water with lemon, she brought me coffee, she brought me tea, she just kept giving me something warm because I needed it at that point. And I thought that was very kind. And so when I said I like Kata, I should, start, I should give them the review on their website. And honestly, my experience too was really very good. We landed safely to the glory of God. Everything went on fine. And... Ah, baggage clean. Only my luggage. On the conveyor belt. Car, yes, you. Oh, um, mom, how want to push this thing with these children? Even and I finally pushed all the luggages outside where I finally met my husband and we decided to take a shot. I'm grateful the journey was for well. I don't even believe that's possible. Black man, I'm faking. I don't know See, if it's me, she's the last night. I'm going to go Yeah, go yata, take me yata. Can you go?